Hey guys, it's Joe Tunney here at Honda of Seattle. I'm actually here live at the Seattle Auto Show taking a look at the all new 2015 Honda CRV. Destined to be a big success for Honda. In fact, this car isn't even on uh, the dealer's showroom floor yet, and it's already been announced today that it's Motor Trend's SUV of the year. Even though the, the differences between 2014 and 2015 are incremental, those incremental gains are so substantial and so complete throughout the entirety of the car that it's actually a different personality altogether in 2015 uh, from its outgoing 2014 model. Now, for me, the uh, I started my career with Honda of Seattle back in 1997 when I first moved to Seattle, and they had released a brand new car that year, the CRV, and it was such a huge hit for Honda. They actually sold 66,000 CRVs in its uh, initial year, and by 2013, those sales figures had escalated to 303,000. And so as we take a look around, one of the things we're going to notice right off the get-go is that the front end, in keeping with the new 2015 Fit, which has also been recently released and also is a major hit for Honda, it is a much more modern aerodynamic front fascia, but also the front end looks uh, much more elegant and refined. In fact, it looks far more elegant and refined than the outgoing 2014 model. Let's take a look around and see uh, exactly what differences there are in 2015. One of them that you'll notice are 18 inch wheels, so a chunkier size. Uh, CRVs typically have had a little bit uh, smaller wheel and tire configuration, but uh, definitely more robust for 2015. Inside, really, really beautiful interior inside with perforated leather, wood grain interior, and much more. Let's come on and take a look around. Now, just like the Fit, which is uh, also new for 2015, you're going to enjoy Honda's Lane Watch feature. And how that works is it's a camera integrated into the right-hand side mirror so that as soon as I turn the turn signal to the right, I actually see the entirety in, uh, of what's in the lane alongside me. So unlike a chime or a chirp or a flashing strobe light like a lot of other brands are doing, you actually have a live camera that gives you a very clear image of what's alongside of you. Also new for 2015, this car comes complete with collision mitigation braking system that uh, adds to the anti-lock brakes with brake assist and electronic brake distribution. And then you also have lane keeping assist as well as the, uh, the right side camera. And then look at the beautiful interior in this car. Perforated leather, wood. Let's jump in the back seat and see how spacious it is. For those of you already familiar with the CRV, you know it enjoys theater style seating. So the folks who sit in the back are actually taller than the folks who sit in the front. So you have a much more uh, uh, wide field of view. Also, I'm six foot 200 pounds and I've got the front seat really far back and I'm actually extremely comfortable in this car. It's very spacious, tons of room inside, tons of headroom, shoulder room. You can fit three adults in here, no problem. Three kids, do that in a breeze. Taking a look in back, again, the finishing touches are different on the 2015, this being the Touring model. And so the nice chrome applique, the two-tone finish, very elegant, very sophisticated, and dare I say posh. It's actually a, a very stylish looking car. New also is the uh, power tailgate release and also uh, return with just a touch of a button. Very, very spacious behind the second row seat. In fact, one of the most spacious in the category. With all that height here, it's a very square design in the back. So not only is it uh, lots of space, but it's a uh, very usable space. And then 60-40 folding rear seats so that I can fold down just the right-hand side and still enjoy enough room for two occupants in the back. On the passenger side, we see that lane watch camera and that's fixed right here at the bottom of the right side mirror. And again, it just gives you an excellent field of view. So if you do have to make a right turn, you don't have to worry about any kind of blind spots. Let's jump inside and take a peek. The leather in this car feels like it's straight out of Acura, not, not out of Honda. And I don't mean that facetiously. It really is nice. This car feels very elegant. Wood grain, again, brand new for Honda. The technology, also brand new for Honda. Big monitor, this has navigation with text features, 
variety of Bluetooth features, the uh, everything that you could possibly want from Pandora to all your apps, everything is right here in the center console. It's a big, beautiful, modern navigation unit. Everything is very, very simple to use, very well thought out. Everything's at thumb's reach. Nothing's out of the way. Nothing. They don't have those iDrive dials or any of these modern gizmos that are more complicated than user-friendly. It's simple like you've come to expect from Honda. It's posh and elegant like you have not come to expect from Honda. It gets 33 miles per gallon out on the open road, which is incredible for a four-wheel drive of this size. It's easy to see why this is already the car of the year. The Honda dealers are dying to get this car on the showroom floor, and it should be uh, available uh, by, uh, at a minimum, the uh, end of October. We're going to see a few of them, and then in uh, more robust numbers, definitely in November. If you have any questions about this car, please don't hesitate to give me a call. My name is Joe Tunney. I'm the General Sales Manager at Honda of Seattle. You can call me anytime at 206-382-8800 or just drop me an email at joet at hondaofseattle.com.